here now one final thing i want us to do is now that when you look at the it means carefully certain figures are not formless whilst others are formless so in financial modeling as a best practice what we do is that we are going to format all the constants okay the hard coded figures here which are not formless as blue okay we are going to format them as blue and then the ones that are formless are going to be formatted as black or they are going to be left as black as we are seeing here so how am i going to do that we are going to i'm going to select all the figures here the entire section here excluding my years of course the 2021 these are also hard coded so i'm not going to include those so i'm going to hit f5 on your keyboard is going to open what you call go to dialog box here so this is the go to dialog box and what you are going to do is come here and come to special so go to special here when you come to special we are going to select constants okay and we are going to exclude texts logicals and errors so we are going to only um, re, um, leave numbers checked okay you are going to uncheck the rest and then you are going to hit okay when you do that it's going to select all the constant figures within our selected area okay so as you can see there all the constants have been selected so i'll come to my font color here under the home tab come to font color click on the um, draw um, on the drop down menu there and then i'm going to hit this blue color here so i'm going to hit the blue here and then it's going to format all my constants as blue now this is a financial modeling a worldly accepted financial modeling practice okay so you should always do this so this is how we're going to wrap up our um first video on our video series in our next video we are going to calculate our ratios and also start our projection of the income statement so do all to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to like the video so that you can reach a lot of people as well and don't forget to share with others so they can come here and learn what you are also learning all right so i'll see you in my next video